do a little stretch warm up, pre-handle it stretch warm up, and we're good. Hey man, you wanna come help me out? Welcome to Handle It. Today, we are gonna be making a mac and cheese pizza. I am Gross Guy, aka Adam, aka Darth Sand. That's my fucking ah. Xbox gamer tag. Add me, I'll fucking ah. play some Halo with you. Bazoo, 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 bazoo. Today we're in the kitchen. I got a sick recipe that I'm gonna teach you guys. It's actually one of my favorites because I like mac and cheese and I'm a big pizza fan. But first, you have to create it. You gotta make the mac and cheese pizza. So take a look at the description for the tools and ingredients and steps and then you could follow along with me. So come on. Where are you going? Um, I was gonna go here. Come on, come here. All right, so step one is make the noodles. So we're gonna set our water to a boil, which it already is almost boiling. So just add your elbow noodles to the water, boil them, wait a little bit, and in time they will be complete. And while this is going, we could get another pot going and start making our cheese. So this is where you add your Velveeta and your milk to the pan and then you actively stir it. You gotta make sure it doesn't burn. We don't want nothing to burn unless it's a big fatty boom batty blunt. Uh, just say, correction, this is a pot. Correction, this is a pan. No. <laughs> all right, so the macaroni is done. We strained it, we got it here. And now what we're gonna do is take all these ingredients and mix them in. Throw them in, mix it around. Little Eggy, Dr. Robotnik, Mr. Eggman. Then you come in and pour these breadcrumbs. So crumb it up, crumb it up. And then, this is where we get a little cheesy. The liquid gold, yeah, get it all in. And now you can use a device to mix it around or you could go all savage, all 21 savage on this noodle bowl and get your fingers in there. Ooh, that's a bad idea. It's hot, eh? That, those are hot noodles. And the cheese is all on your hands. Yeah, oh, that is really hot. <laughs> You're stuck with it now. <laughs> you made that into your life. Well, um, you guys are gonna wanna use a wooden spoon and don't use your fingers. Noodle dough is ready to go. So first off, you're gonna wanna take a few breadcrumbs, sprinkle it on your pizza tray, just as though it's flour, you know? Let's do this. So you wanna scoop it in one as best you can so it holds itself together. And then once it's on there, you're gonna wanna pat it down. Okay, so we breadcrumb the bottom, now we're gonna breadcrumb the top. You know, do you know how many times breadcrumbs helped me find my way home? A lot, every time I went to a new place, my parents were always like, Adam, bring, bread, bring some breadcrumbs because you might not be able to find your way home. And every single fucking time, granted if it doesn't rain, if it does rain, you're gonna get the, it's gonna wash the breadcrumbs away, but it doesn't matter, just bring enough breadcrumbs for a few miles and go on a little hike. Go to the closest stable with some breadcrumbs in your hand and sprinkle them on the ground so you can find your way home. Okay, let's go put this in the oven. What's our oven at, here? 400, we're at 400 degrees on bake. So that's what you're gonna wanna do, huh? Okay, while the pizza crust is in the oven for about 25 minutes, we have enough time to handle the bacon. Obviously, you're gonna wanna top your pizza with bacon unless you're some sort of little bitch. Yeah, I agree. Right, okay, so, you know, bacon bits on the pizza. The food is almost done, so I'm gonna finish up this shrine in Zelda. Why are you promoting that ah. system? Oops. Fine, you know what? We can't all be fans of Ghostbusters the movie, Amir. Ah. you. We're rolling. Hey. Hey, what are you doing over here? You should take a spoon to smooth out the sauce. Smooth out the sauce? I could use my hand. I don't want you to. I could you use might, my... You might damage the crust. I could use my foot. The crust is fragile. Have you ever Bismarcked a plate of spaghetti? No, make it. I'm hungry. Okay, so the noodle dough is out. Did you get that garbage out of the shot? It's really disgusting. Harley? Uh -huh. We got the noodle dough out. It's been in the oven. It's ready to get dressed. I'm really good at dressing things. I got two nieces and a mom. Okay, so first up, uh, we're gonna use the tomato sauce to pour on this. That's gonna be the base, the first layer. Do you like it saucy? Yeah, I'm having some of this. Yeah, you're gonna have some saucy pizza? Why are you putting the pepperoni under the cheese? It's Amir's instructions. Why do you do that? No, it's not. What do you mean it's smart? It's the worst way to do it. The only people that do that and gets away with it is Maury's, and that's because they put it in the cheese, not under it. You know, if I was making this, I'd put the pepperonis on top. Yippee! I also wanted to put the pepperonis on top, but Amir was like... <laughs> so then you add the cheese after the pep. You gotta put the cheese on the pep. Cheese, cheese, cheese. You know what, I went to Milan and they taught me how to make pizza in Italy and they did it exactly like this. The bacon, the bacon, the bacon, the bacon. Oh sh <laughs> Boom shakalaka. Slam dunk it like you're playing NBA Jam. 
on Sega Genesis in 1994. Okay, so the pizza's fully dressed. We have to bake it a second time until the cheese melts or until it's a golden brown and just looks scrumptious. Guys, we're done. The mac and cheese pizza is ready to go. We could eat it. Who wants a piece? Anyone want a piece? Who wants to come eat my pizza? But it could be your pizza. You could take this recipe and copyright it yourselves and open up your own restaurant and serve this pizza to people and not credit us. That's how the world works today. Also, I've been reading the comments. You guys wanna know how we look so good. Uh, let me know, his beauty salon does all the makeup and hair for every shoot. So if you guys want, he's very affordable. Just hit him up on Twitter. Okay, anyway, so like, favorite, subscribe. This is the mac and cheese pizza and it is gonna be delicious. I'm gonna cut it up and I'm gonna serve it to my friends who work here. Let's do that.